Great Lakes is sort of a bellwether for craft brewing in Ontario. 2006, when they released Devil's Pale Ale, that was sort of the first big American-style craft beer and the first sort of canned beer that was gimmicky in the way that American craft beer is gimmicky. And it's retired now. But it seems like Great Lakes is just ahead of the curve. The OCB, they had a strategic consultant. And they said people are going to start moving away from imports and start to head craft. And we thought, well, let's try to be on top of that. So we introduced Devil's Pale Ale in 2006. And it was something that uh, the team and I were talking about for a while to sort of change this, get off the lager thing and let's try an ale. And uh, said, oh, let's try to come up with something flavorful and unique. And then came up with Devil's and Triple Six and all this sort of, you know, the devil made me brew it. We launched at the Toronto Festival of Beer, and it was incredible because we brought, I don't know, like 200 and some odd t-shirts. And in the past, like, no, you wouldn't be able to sell a t-shirt at a beer festival. Everyone wants it for free. And we bring these t-shirts, and everyone's chomping at the bit for them. And we sold out, like, it was over 200 shirts, which basically paid for the booth, and, you know, and it was just mind-blowing. So then you're seeing all these kids running around the city with these shirts on and drinking the beer, which was, which was big and bold for the time, for sure gothic beer you know it was uh, it was good times I started at the brewery we were brewing uh, Devil's Pale Ale it was you know our, our up-and-coming super cool beer big flavor big body um, you know funky branding but we were borrowing uh, a little I don't even think it was mobile but it, we made it a mobile canning uh, machine from a brewery in uh, Niagara on the Lake I think we probably got about 60, maybe 60% of it into cans and the rest would just be wasted on the floor. And our canning process was god-awful. There was no uh, Sessions craft canning available to come to your facility. There was some guys trying to do that and they were early days of doing it, but it was, it was bad. And we finally bought our own machine, so that was smart. And once the cans started going out, they were just flying like we couldn't make enough.